uh, diff ratio is explained. So I wanted to work out what uh, ratio it was. So what you need to do is you need to count the teeth on your crown wheel. So as you can see, I just got a little bit of um, yellow spray paint, just sort of clean it up a little bit, put a little mark on it. It's not going to harm anything, uh, just so I could see where I was starting from. And then I just literally rotated around and went one, two, three, four, blah, 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 blah. So this is 43 teeth on the crown wheel. And I did the same with the pinion. So as I can said, as I said before, you can see the pinion up there with those uh, sort of curved gears. I'll just try and focus on that a little bit better. Up the top there. So you can just sort of see them, you know, the gears. You can see that little bit of paint there. So I did the same thing there. So it's, this has 11 on the pinion and 43 on the crown wheel. So that gives me a 3.909 ratio. So you go 43 divided by 9. Oh, sorry, 43 divided by 11 equals 3.909. So that gives me a 3.9 ratio diff. Um, if it was 43 and 10, obviously that's 4.3. Uh, when you divide those each other, oh god, the focusing is terrible. Uh, so yeah, that's uh, this is an 8 inch Toyota diff, so this is very common for um, Hiluxes. Uh, some Supras, uh, Chasers, that sort of stuff. Uh, but yeah, that's basically how you uh, work out your crown wheel and pinion ratio.